Okay, this is a very quick run through of my latest ROM. This is Android 2.2 with Next Theme themed over it. First thing you're going to notice is uh, Launcher Pro here by Federico Carnales. This is a really cool uh, home replacement. It's really fast, really feature, uh, full featured. It's got this Sense UI like leap feature. Uh, you can also activate it by pinching the home screen, but I've only got one hand here. Um, so that's really quick, and Froyo makes it even better. Um, so let's just go into settings here, just to show you the Android version 2.2, um, Mode Roller Droid. So uh, there are tons of new features in 2.2. Uh, don't really have time to go through all of them, but some of the really best ones are... Uh, right here in uh, wireless network settings. If you go to tethering, you can see USB tethering. You can check that when it's connected to your computer and you can just share your internet connection that way. Uh, if you want to share your internet connection with some other devices, you can also use the included wireless tethering application. And this will turn your phone to a mobile hotspot, uh, which you can connect Wi-Fi devices to. Also, the market's been changed up a little bit, so if you take a look, uh, you have this automatic updating feature. You also have separate comments for about, and com separate tabs, I'm sorry, and you can also rate comments, uh, just little things. Uh, the messaging app is a little bit different too. Um, now, inside threads, your contacts also have pictures. Uh, some people don't like this, but I've got pictures for most of my friends, so it's pretty nice for me. Um, the camera is much improved over 2.1. As you can see, um, it takes pictures fairly quickly, so let's see. I got a picture of my headphones here. Also, these icons down here will rotate with rotate along with your phone as you switch them. A full 360. <laughs> and then, once you have those pictures taken, you go to the gallery, and uh, it loads up quite a bit faster than 2.1. And also, the problem in 2.1 where if you zoomed in really close. It got really pixelated. Uh, that's not the case anymore. Can't really tell on a video, but if you see it in person, uh, you can you can see. Also, um, let's see, it comes at 600 megahertz, but with set CPU, you can clock it all the way up to one gigahertz with even more kernels to go higher if you want. Um, not really sure why you would need to go faster than that on Froyo. It's it's really really fast. So take a look at this impact benchmark. You can go anywhere from 14 to 15 megaflops. Oh, that one was a dud. Yeah, anywhere as high as 15 megaflops at one gigahertz. So if you're looking for a ROM that's quick, good looking, and uh, on the cutting edge of Android. You should give this one a try. The link is in the video description. So check it out and then uh, visit the thread. Report your bugs and let me know how you like it.